<laughs> we go out there and crush anything that we're put up against, and, and that's pretty much the, the real theory behind this band. It's like a doomsday machine. I learned all the songs and I went down and I auditioned. Uh, I was about 15 or 16, and it was it was no problem for me because I was like a roadie or a tech for the band, so I was used to seeing the crowd doing the show all the time, and just stepping out onto it was no problem. That's when we were going to the moon and stuff, and people were just scared shit of what was out there in space and what was going to be coming back in. And it was a very serious thought to me when these cards came out. They were actually banned soon after. So I went downstairs and I pulled out the cards and I just started writing the story the way the cards went, and uh, it seemed to work that way. And Everything seemed lost. I'm hard to bet, and I can see no matter what the cost. The voice is sore, the sound is deep upon the marching door. The voice is dark, the thunder that mines would be no more. See the world to me, swear. See the dark to me, the tribe. Oh, I was attacked. If I don't choose to bet. You're looking at a band that started in the late 70s and here you are in the late 90s and we're still a new band. Speak of the devil. What the devil?
to the devil. This is not a reunion. This is a brand new band coming up with with the same uh, attack pattern as the old, but in, in the future, we actually like bridged a gap in time. Uh, when it came time to write the Psycho album, we had about five or six songs in the hole, uh, which uh, pretty much made the album all except for one. And uh, we wrote um, 30 songs in like a month and a half. So we were just like a songwriting uh, machine gun there for a while. I think without the new material, where's our credibility? Who are we without any new material? We would just be a cover band, and uh, that's, you know, I would ra I'd rather plant corn where I live and uh, raise cattle than to become a cover band. I, you know, day one, picking up a guitar, I said, my own stuff or nothing. So, uh, you know, that's still something that I try and live by. It's never been about money for us. It's always been about going out there and really ripping people apart. And uh, I think we do it better than anybody out there. I think we got about the best live act that's uh, rolled out of this century. And, uh, you know, people that don't like us, we beat them up. <laughs> <laughs>